I got a chance to lead the Newport band last night. And so they had gave out, they had 47 seniors that were graduating. The place was packed. They gave them all a bunch of awards, all wonderful musicians. And then they said, before your last, before you leave the stage for the last time, you get an opportunity to be led by John Curley, who has a radio show like, on... Who's John Curley? Yeah. And they didn't even know where it was? No, but they remembered King 5 Evening Magazine. Oh, great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Then, the uh, then they, so these seniors got a chance to have me lead them. And then I realized it's the last time they're going to play on stage. It's going to be led by me. How oh, sad. <laughs> so I explained to them, I said, now listen, when I played for St. Elish's Academy Marching Band, Sister Barbara Tucker, a rather zoftic woman with blind in one eye, she basically ignored the saxophone section to the right because she couldn't see any of us. So we sort of just <laughs> had to go on our own. So saxes, I'm sorry, you're on your own. The lady said to me, are you, are you practice getting ready? Hold on a second. Do you know how to start them? Which, Tom, is a big deal. Did you know that? Well, I assume so. Well, no, you gotta... you're the one who said yesterday it's not a big deal. Right? I know, so I didn't yeah. read any of the emails. <laughs> you didn't. You didn't watch the video that told you. No, how to I didn't bother. Oh my god! So I, I got guys ready. Man. So they all stand up. I sit them down. I tap on the thing. I lift up. I look down like this. Nothing. <laughs> so I start again. Down. Nothing. And they're like waiting, and then I hear the one kid go one and two, and I go no 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 no. They were like a chainsaw with the uh, kill switch on. I couldn't get them to go. And finally, I had to call in somebody else. I had to call in the other conductor. Were they doing this as no, a joke? Because no, because if you don't, if you don't, you can do this. Yeah. You have to. You have to look at them. Yeah. Okay. You can't look down and do that. You have to look at them and then bang, which I didn't have. Silence each time. It was the weirdest thing. <laughs> the crowd. I think they're just pulling your leg. No, they weren't. <laughs> okay. They weren't. They were really, they were, then I could tell, like, especially the piccolos, because they're the most sensitive. <laughs> they felt sorry for me. There's, you know, the stars and stripes. Yeah. Two, four time. Yeah. <laughs> it's so, great. So once you got them started, Oh, there was you go. They went, boom, boom, boom. Then I was like, this was just great. It was all over there. Then they had another baton. So I had two batons going. <laughs> Turn around, I got the crowd going with me. It was really something. Yeah, the so, most disappointing thing too. One, they had never heard of the radio show. Two, wow, they don't know how to do that. <laughs> no, they they knew you they didn't know, know how, how to. Do that. that. <laughs> That's the sad thing. Not All these Tom seniors not know how to start. Number how one. How could they have heard not a turn? Tom and Curly show number one. That's why you go out in public, John. That's right. Spread the word. That's right. <laughs>